What up, Nick from Fisherman Source? Got one here about Albies, favorite Albie lures. Everybody knows about the hoagie epoxy jig that's become all but the standard in chasing Albies around. The Joe bags, resin jigs have become very popular, but one of our favorites at the store is the Tsunami Forktail Candy. It swims good and they, they just seem to bite it. I definitely would change the hooks out, which I do with a lot of stuff. Colors, you know, chartreuse or Albie crack, as they call this, pinks, glows, whites, olives, golds. Those are kind of where I keep it. You could go as crazy as you want, fishing it on usually a 4,000 size reel, 15 pound braid and a seven, seven and a half foot medium or medium heavy stick. Generally want to fish as small as I can, throw in the half ounce, half ounce fork tail candies or a 5 8 epoxy. If you can cast it and you're not dealing with crazy wind, that's the way to go. But also they're not always feeding on tiny snot rain bait. A lot of times they are, but not always. We've had a lot of fish eating, you know, two, three, four inch snappers, and uh, the hoagie jig seems to get them whatever they're eating. Um, they all cast really well. Three quarter, or this is seven eighths, seems to be a good weight. That's kind of universal in terms of casting and fishing it. The epoxy jigs skip better on a real, real, real fast retrieve, which sometimes is necessary, but sometimes I cast these out and let them sink and just kind of work them back to the boat when the albies have gone down. Just three of our favorites at the store. Albies are the, known to be the most finicky fish ever, so this is by no means, you know, the Bible of albie fishing. It's just some of our favorites. Until next time, keep them tight. See ya.